Hi and welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing a quick unboxing, review and demo of the Nine Stars Automatic Infrared Trash Can. I personally have had the same trash bin for a long time. It's a regular standard plastic bin. We decided since we don't have a place where we can hide the trash bin, it was time to invest in a nice looking trash can. We looked up reviews before choosing this one and we're gonna go ahead and open it, test it out and see how well it works. Okay, so this is the box it arrived in. It's clearly labeled here, nine stars, automatic infrared trash can, 13.2 gallons. I already uh, cut open the box and this is the way that it comes packaged. Good protection here, so we take this out. All right, so inside, let's take a closer look. You can see that the bin is in here and inside is the actual lid and it's held in place by another piece of packaging. So it was resting right in here and then here we have the lid and now we're going to take out the bin and in the bottom of the box you can also see there's another piece of packaging in there to hold the bin in place. So it was very well packaged. Now we're going to take it out of the bag that it comes in. This is a little ring that holds your trash bag in place. So let's take this out. Very lightweight, so it's easy to move it around. And this is what the inside looks like. It looks like there's plastic at the bottom. This is what the base looks like. One thing I noticed immediately, I can touch it and you know how stainless steel gets those fingerprints on it and markings, but this has some type of protection where it doesn't allow the fingerprints to stay on, which is amazing. I love that already. Now I'm going to test out how easy it is to put a clean bag in it. These are the ones that I have at home. They're just a standard 13 gallon. And in my regular trash bin, these are always falling back into the bag, into the bin once I put trash in it. But we'll see how it works with the ring that it comes that holds it in place. You don't see the bag hanging out on the side of the trash bin, which already is a big improvement. Now we're gonna open up the lid. And here we have the warranty registration and the user's manual. Here you have step-by-step -step how to set up your trash bin with pictures and everything. Let's take a closer look. On the top, you have a little metallic plate that has the nine stars logo and it says nine stars on it. You have the close button and the open button. This one is the manual handle that you can just use to open it up and it stays up. And right here in the center, you can see the little infrared motion detecting sensor. Now we'll flip it over and we can see on the back, there's a power saving on off switch. The hidden compartment here is where you would put the batteries and it takes three C batteries. And now we're gonna go ahead and place the lid on the trash can. See how it looks. It has a beautiful sleek design. I love it. And here you can clearly see the difference between my before trash and my after trash. You can use the handle to open the trash can manually. And look, the bag doesn't fall in. mention is the fact that the opening is large enough even though it looks pretty sleek it's still large enough where you can fit an entire gallon of milk right in the opening without any problems even though I personally like to crush the container to make more space in my trash bin the trash can does not come with the batteries but we went ahead and purchased these energizer size C batteries and this pack comes with four but you only need three we're gonna go ahead and open the compartment for the batteries and remove the cover, which is this one. We're gonna insert the, the three batteries. It's easy to see how they are positioned because there's a drawing in the bottom. You put the cover back on and this is where you turn it on. Now we're gonna test out the sensor. You come with your trash, this is what I wanna throw out, and the infrared, which is right here, is aiming upward so I'm gonna just hover my hand over it to see how close I have to be in order for it to pick up that there's something there. 
One great thing about this is that when, if you have more than one item to throw out, let's say you have a plate that you want to empty out, as long as the infrared senses that you're there, it'll stay open. And the moment you throw it out and move away from it, it'll give you a second and then close. You can also use the open button to leave it open until you're done and then press the close button. That's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Thanks so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye.